Welcome back to more Asha in Monster World, everybody. I know it's been a while. It's definitely been like over a week since I last recorded the series. I've just been a really book with other series and all that good stuff. But now I'm actually going to have some time, finally, to come back here and continue with this series. Beat the Queen? Yes. Hmm. Yes. That title for sure. Please go right in. Why, thank you. Thank you very much. Couple of good action basics for if you jump while carrying, you can glide in the air for a while. Yeah, we're actually about to get introduced to that mechanic very, very soon, actually. We'll see. Royal Palace. Skip? Nah. Why would I skip this, right? Hello, princess. Oh my god, you look like Princess Peach. Sort of, obviously, only in some ways. I'm not saying it's a complete copy, it's not. Actually, it's kind of a mix of, like, Zelda and Peach, isn't it? Sort of. Like, I can see a resemblance with Zelda too in some ways. I, I don't know. Welcome to Rapadagna, the oasis in the desert. The people of Rapadagna bid you welcome. Now, to bestow upon you the title of warrior. To become a warrior, you must swear to act, to always act bravely, and fight to protect all peace-loving people at the peril of your own life. Do you so swear? Yes. I hereby grant you the title of warrior. Really? So any random person can just walk in here and swear and they become a warrior? Really? Okay. Hmm, asking me what? Practice fate? Asha, noble warrior, we need your help. I have dire news. Something is happening to the four spirits that have protected this land for age upon age. The dark clouds in the far sky are an ill omen. If this should continue, the city will be shrouded in darkness. So it is I... Wait, so it is I beseech you. Save the four spirits and defeat the power of darkness that has spawned the dark clouds. Please say you'll help us. Yes. You will? Thank you. On behalf of all our people, you must first save the Earth Sprite. Okay. Um, sure. Wait, I can't... Oh, there we go. It's like, what the heck? Go to the vault here in this palace. There's an item that'll unlock the temple door. Okay, so the vault. Where the heck is the vault again? I'm trying to remember this. Um, I can't go left or right. I can talk to these people, but they don't really tell me anything. At least not yet. Alright, so we're just gonna go... I think we gotta leave here. We're gonna go to the right. Here. This is it. Okay, we're gonna open all these treasures, which is amazing. That right there is Pepelagu egg. Okay. And here's the Earth Medallion, we're gonna need that too. And I believe the last two are just like money. And that too, okay, I'll take it. Oh, that's the elixir, okay. And that's a gold bar, okay. That's pretty good. Um, I think that might be it here, I don't know if there's anything in these other rooms. I feel like there isn't. This is just like artwork, if you want to see artwork. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, see, this is just... Monsters. We must train hard for battle. Yeah, it's not really anything there. Okay. And I don't think there's anything on the left either. The left side. There's a door there. Oh, yeah. huh. Yes, I've tried it before. Oh, yeah. What happens if I say no? It's really tasty. There actually is something up there, but oh, the problem is I can't get it right now. It's a little too, uh, a little too high up. There's also one thing over there. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's try this door. These are all just, like, books and stuff. Yeah. I'm not gonna go with that right now. No way. Alright, so we're gonna leave this palace because now we have to go and... Oh, wait, here I can also go left and right? The thing is, I don't think there's actually... 
Definitely not. Um... Like, aren't these... These are the same ones that I already... Yeah. Well, damn, it's kind of a confusing place, but it's fine. Oh, I actually got that. Okay, that's pretty good that I found it then. Okay, hopefully that was it for that. I'm not actually sure. I know there's more stuff that I can get a little bit later, but... I mean, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, before we proceed into the dungeon, we actually have to go and, um... Go in here. Here we go. Here's the egg. What's happening? Here we go. Oh my god, this is such a prolonged hatch. Like, come on, everyone's just waiting. There we go. So that right there is the Pepeligoo. I actually don't, don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I've always called them Pepeligoos. Um, I don't know. I have no idea. Basically, you hold R, or you press R, my bad. You press R once, it comes back to you. Wait. Or do you have to hold it? Oh no, you do have to hold it. Never mind. Okay. You hold it and then you do your stuff. Yes, if that, if that makes any sense. Um, okay, so what we're gonna do here... I'm gonna go in this building, because I believe this lady here... Uh-huh. I'll buy them from you. No. Have it your way. Oh, they took out that mechanic, huh? In the old game, they actually... you could refuse it and then it would give you more. <laughs> That's interesting. Anyway, I got that. I needed that. That money there, and you'll see why, because I'm definitely going to need that, like, really badly. There's also... Um, I think... Where was that? Oh, it's up there. I'm going to have to go over there. Okay, well... It would be from the left side, then. Because I definitely want to grab that stuff. I also want to go in the shop and buy a better sword. That's going to be very important. So there's two options here. Um, this one obviously is better. It costs a lot of money. It costs pretty much all my money though. But I'm going to have to do it. There we go. I think I need to equip it as well. Let's go and pause. Yep. We're going to do that. And our attack power is two. Which is pretty awesome. All right, now we're gonna go back. I think I have to take this door here so I can get up to the top. I believe that's how that works. Yes, okay, I was just forgetting there for a quick sec. Okay, I don't think there's anything over there. Okay, so you just jump and you hold. The big thing that I wanna get from this is coming all the way Wait, that, that actually allows it to go to the back? Oh, whoops. God dang it. There we go. You can do a double jump off of it if you press B again. Kind of interesting. Oh, shoot. Get over here. I think that's actually it for... Yeah, that's it. Okay. And I'm just going to press X now. I don't know if I missed anything else different now, but either way, I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to go to the left because I think we're good to go. I know there is one more of those things I can get over there. Ah, uh, you know what? I should just grab it right now. Okay, so it's basically in... Uh, I'm trying to remember. It's a little further into the left? Or is it on the right? Oh, shoot. I think it's actually here and then to the left. Why did I for- what the heck? Oh, I was stuck there somewhere. 
No, it's not here. It's, um, I think it's around. It goes like this. And here. I think it's in this room. Right there. So that's another one. And then there's another one up here. And I think that's it. There's another one, like, way higher up. In the... That room, but I don't think I can get that one right now. Like, I'm pretty sure I can't. I can try to experiment with it and see, but... Yeah, no, I definitely can't, um... Go that way. Okay. <clears throat> That's fine. Well, actually, I think I could just jump over the pot with the pebble goo. I don't have to go around to go back into the throne room. It's fine. But at least I got two more of these things. That's very important. Because, you know, the more I have these, like, sooner, the easier it's going to be, you know, just overall the game's going to be easier because you get more hearts sooner. And extra hearts is really good, obviously. Alright, so now we're going to finally progress. We're going to go over here. Is there anything further to the left? I believe the answer is no. I'm just making sure. Okay, we're going to go here. Now we have to pick the right one. Wait, is it the one to the left? Yes, it is. This is the Earth Medallion. Okay, and we are here in the Mountain Path. So this place is going to lead us to... Eventually... The next dungeon. Alright, so I'm here all we gotta do is, you know, defeat all these enemies. It's pretty straightforward here, actually. There's some signs. Use your pepper with a double jump? Yeah, I already talked about that. But yeah, see, it's a it's a pretty basic concept, you know, at least as of now. I mean, the game gets more complicated later on, of course. Whoops, I let, I let him hit me. Just make sure to grab all the money. You're gonna need a lot of money in this game for good upgrades and stuff. Like, very good stuff. Like, for example, having this sword with two attack, basically doubling your strength. And it is able to kill enemies twice as fast. It's able to... Deal with bosses twice as fast, just lots of good stuff. If you don't have it, you feel kind of handicapped by this point. What is this? Watch your feet. <clears throat> I will. I'll try. Oh, that one fell. Oh well. I don't really need the pep go right now, it's just basic jumps. Okay, further if you hold. Yeah, of course, okay. Now we're gonna get introduced to this concept. Uh-huh. And see, it's... It's all pretty straightforward, right? Okay, oh, that's a little problematic right there. Okay, I think in here I need to... Yep, I'm gonna go down here. No! What, what, what was that? Oh, shoot. Sorry, I thought... Oh, my God. <laughs> my bad. That was my fault. Why did I do that? Totally my fault, of course. Yeah, I actually don't know why I did that, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> oh, God. See, you can also jump to, like platforms and stuff. That part I didn't actually know. I don't know. I don't know if you could have done that in the original game. Like, I'm just jumping through platforms, for the most part. I want this money, but... No, I didn't mean to shoot. 
There we go. Give me that heart. Yeah, I took damage by falling. That's a lot of money. Okay. These guys are pretty easy if you have the double attack, to be honest, because you can just get up to them fast before they land the hit on you and kill them. And they're giving me some of these teardrop things, so that's good. Okay, we're going to open this thing. And this here contains... Bomb. Very nice, very nice. What's over here? Anything? No. Okay, we're just going to place the bomb here. Yeah, this next dungeon is pretty much all about bombs. It's about finding treasures that contain bombs so that we can actually progress further. Every bomb you get, so it's not like Zelda, you get the bombs and like, that's it, you just refill on bombs by pickups through like, enemies? No. You have to keep getting individual bombs. It's like, I got a bomb right there, but there's still, you know, like, there's still a lot more boulders, so I need to get more bombs. Um, okay, we're gonna go... Oh shoot, these are new enemies, yeah. Those things will actually eventually hurt you. But I mean you need to wait, how do you hold on. That's strange. I mean I can jump on them. Okay, so here's a new concept. You throw the thing, and then you, you know, land on them. And there we go. It's a pretty simple mechanic, of course. Just don't touch the lava, it will hurt you. Trust me on that. Alright, then we're gonna go through here. Pretty straightforward stuff like always. What the heck? Those enemies are a little... a little ruthless, I will say. Okay, I'll throw you there. And again, same thing. I need you, please. Wait, how do you... There we go. Okay, watch out for those things. They are dropping some stuff. Dude, those enemies are a little tricky to hit. The angle's a little awkward. Oh, shoot. Um, I don't need to go over there. That's just to go back down, which I don't have to do. There's a boulder here, so we're gonna place the bomb. And there we go. Okay, next room. Simple enough. Those things remind me of freaking Gatsumon. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know if any of you know who Gatsumon is. If you, if you don't know, Google it. G-O-T-S-U-M-O-N It's a Digimon, of course. There we go. Just use the Peplicu and you'll be fine. Okay. Going higher. Oh, watch out for that. Mm, nothing really here, okay. I mean, it's fairly straightforward, to be honest. Like, there's nothing crazy here. Ah, oh, there's a boulder there. Got it, got it. Go, go, go. I just I just threw my peplico over there against the wall. That's freaking crazy. Alright, so here's another bomb. Oh my god. Oh shoot. There we go. Did that? Oh shoot, I had to do it twice. Damn it. There we go. Like that, and we got a boulder here. Alright, and that's pretty straightforward there. Now we're just gonna go through. I'm telling you, it's a very straightforward dungeon for the most part. Um, do I have to drop down? I guess I gotta drop down. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. I'm, do I'm doing this because sometimes there's like things in the, in the, you know, that like you can miss. Okay, uh, what does this say actually? Pebbles compressed switches. Ah, yes, just simply throw it. It didn't work that time. Wait, how do you do this? Oh, you gotta throw it. There we go. Oh, like that. See what I'm saying? You can miss that. We'll take this. Oh, sweet. Next up is, can also be thrown upward. Oh, that's how you do it. Yeah, like that. There we go. Just simply press up on the stick and you'll be fine. Okay, so that made this work. I don't think there was anything on the right, right? L let me make sure. No. There was not. Oh, shoot. There's money there. Is it really worth it for one? Probably not, but whatever. It's fine. Okay, all good. Press that right there. Oh, okay, watch out for this here. Watch out where the little things are coming from. The next, next one's there. Oh, I think that's it. There we go. Okay. Oh, jeez. I missed something up there. I'm pretty sure. I think I did. Sadly, fall the way through. There was not really much I could do there. Warning, don't put anything into the hole. Oh, got it, got it. So obviously we know that means put something in the hole. There we go. Okay, now here you gotta be careful. I mean, if you want this item. There's a chest here. And that one contains bomb. Nice. Now we gotta do it again. Throw them. And this time we have to make it to the very top. Bomb time. Yeah, so far I think I've missed one treasure. I think. Or whatever that was in there. I think I missed something very important over there. Okay, I can't- well, there's something on the left there, that's gonna shoot some fire and stuff. I don't know what's down here, actually. Why oh, did it? There we go. I don't think I want to go over there yet, though. Come this way. Yep, I was right. Getting the treasure first, what is this? Another bomb. Perfect. Okay, and then, whoa, I did this. Oh, shoot. I have to be quite careful here. Oh my god. There's, I think there's something on the right, though. Is this the rope? Oh, that hurts me? That only hit the peplagoo, man. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, this is definitely a pain in the ass, this place. I remember it very well. And you also can't hang on to the thing when, you, when you're carrying a peplagoo. Gotta be careful about that. Okay, we made it. I don't know if I missed something though. That that room is a little a little ridiculous. 
Hopefully we're fine. Oh, okay, this is the mid boss. This is not the final boss of this dungeon, it's the mid mid section boss, I guess you can say. Um Oh shoot. My bad. It's for the most part fairly simple. Um you wanna do a double jump when you use this fire and attack it. Shit, I missed. Whoa, what the heck was that? Oh my god, can you please land your hit? Oh my god, I died. I have to use an elixir already. Yeah, one of the things that's very tricky about this game is the range of your sword. It's terrible. You have to practically be kissing the enemy to be able to do any damage, and you've kind of probably noticed that already. Like, you have to be incredibly close to an enemy to do any kind of damage. Okay, I don't know what happened to my Peplogu there, but... Stop moving this way, jeez. Jeez, man. I think I just gotta brute force just by this point, because it's not working out. Okay. It's working now. Got you. Oh boy, was that rough right there. More so in the beginning. Alright, so I killed, I think it's called like the Harpy enemy or something. Harpy boss, whatever. Alright, now we can keep proceeding. Uh, let's see. Um, hold on. I don't know if I can come back up that way. No, I should be able to. Yeah, okay, well, sorry, I thought, I, thought, I thought it was like steeper. Yeah, I wasn't actually sure. Okay. Seriously? Hit the thing! You're right! Th Did you really just let that thing hit you twice, Asha? You're so dumb with your garbage sword. The sword's terrible. Okay, um... There, we gain another heart now. That's pretty good. Oh, God. I have to check up here. Okay, that's the boulder. And then, down here... Oh, here's a chest. Money! I'll gladly take that money. Okay, now I gotta go up back up. And then in here, we're gonna have to go... through the left side. Alright, let's see. We got another treasure here. What is that down there in the bottom left? I saw something. There's the bomb. Perfect. Well, they're making it this far. <laughs> so random. Alright, here we go. Bam, all the way up. Alright, then back up through this door. Alright, that's it. Time for another bomb. I don't know how many more there are, but I know that we're... I don't know, there's still a little bit more for sure left. In this dungeon, so I mean, we're getting there slowly, you know? Oh, it's these things. They give a little bit more money, they take two hits. At least with your upgraded sword. There we go.
Yes, we're at around the 30 minute mark now for this video. I mean, I don't know, we're gonna keep these videos somewhere around 30 to before 40 minutes. It's somewhere in the 30 mark. Whoa. Um. Guess we'll just go like this, sure. Kill that guy. Oh, I shouldn't have thrown him. We'll just, uh. I think I'm gonna need to throw you there, though. Actually, there was both the left and the right. Oh, jeez. Those things, like, always give you hearts, it seems. I mean, I don't need to pick up the hearts if I'm already at full health. Okay, got a couple of those. That's pretty good. Whoops, I should have ran into that. You can turn left to right while using your shield. I do know that. It's a very randomly placed hint. Unless we're about to use it right now, if that's what you mean. Yeah, so for those of you just don't even attack them, uh, wait until they're gonna jump over you and then unmorph, see? And it's honestly pretty simple. There's five of these in here? Jesus. Yeah, there were five of those. There were actually five of those things in here. Wow. And then we got more Gatsumons. Whoa, that one uh definitely bounced around a little bit more there. Oh, what the heck was that? Okay, it's all just about defeating the enemies. Getting a lot of money here. That's it for that too. And there's another relics there. I'll take that. Was there a platform down there? There is. There is a platform down here. Oh, pfft. I, I thought it, for some reason I thought it was like lava down there. Never mind. Okay. Any enemies here? There are some enemies here. Oh shoot! That one might hit me. This is a great, a fantastic way to get a lot of money. So if I'm at 1743 gold, they give you 20 each, which is not bad. You know, 20 per. Shoot. Okay, that was a little unexpected there. Go, go, go. Kind of seeing if there's like a pathway I need to be taking. Uh, not really, no. Oh god. What are you doing? Why did you throw that? That was weird. I don't think I pressed the button. Oh my god, these things are... Give me the heart. Give me the heart. There's a switch over there on the right. I took three. I took four damage there. I, I healed one back, which was good, but my god. My god, was that awful. Okay, so here's this. Got a gold bar. Okay, so there's these two. I don't remember which one actually... ...leads to where I want to go. Is that... oh god, I think I took the wrong one then. Shit. Let's try this one. Aha. Okay, so it's good that I did that. I'm gonna jump in here, and we just gotta go back up there. I 
think we're almost at the end. Uh, I don't think we're going to fight the boss in this video, there's like no way. But, we're pretty close, for the most part. Um, okay, so we're going to go- oh shoot. What the freaking hell? Okay, give me these. Getting some hearts, that's good. Even though I took damage here, I should be a little bit more careful here. Whoa, 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 whoa. No! I went too fast again. Damn it. I gotta heal. I gotta heal. Oh, God. There we go. Are you sick? Me and my terrible luck over here. I just, I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, man. Oh, he wasn't jumping anyway. That was a little strange there. Go ahead. Okay. We got that thing. We're not going to do that. And there we go. We did it. We hit that ghost thing. Just got to be careful here. Alright, hit that please. Oh shoot. I'm gonna leave that heart right there. Freaking hell. I, could, I, I couldn't move because of the cutscene. Oh, that's so cheap, dude. That is so cheap. Oh, uh, you have to hit that, please. There we go. Oh, God. Did not come fast enough. What the heck was that? Something didn't work there, whatever that was. Also, one thing that I don't like about this is that basically the whole game you're going to be hearing that annoying sound. What the freaking hell? Oh, there's an item here. I guess I should have fallen anyway. Got some money. But yeah, that annoying sound, that's going to be consistent throughout the entire game. So like if you're... Oh my god, I fell all the way down. So like if you're finding that annoying, you're going to have to deal with it because there's no way to... At least I don't think so. There's like no way to shut that off. Okay, what the heck is wrong with me now? I'm really playing like garbage. Okay. I don't know how to do this. Maybe I just... Hold on, I think I have an idea. There we go, that's better. I think I'm almost there. I mean, I should be. There's a door. Uh, I'm gonna have to end it here regardless. So before this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications. If you enjoyed the video, I do post multiple gaming videos daily, so be sure to check out my channel. Goodbye everyone, have a great day.